Hello, this is Rafsan the Bora Bai. Today I'm going to show you how to make a discovery mind blown. Today I'm making a floating ball, a spinning robot, and a rocket launcher. It, yep, me and my brother used to play that game because we like it a lot. And after we play a ball that floats, and it floats whenever it falls out, whenever it goes off of the air. Whenever it is that, does that, whenever you put your hand on the air and press the button on the rocket, it launches out. I keep on struggling to put it, the rocket in, and then my brother presses the button, and then it launches out. And then we play this game a lot because it was so cool. I tried to put the rocket in, but it can't, but I put it hard and then it got in. And after I put, got the ball into the air and then it fell. And after that, place the ball and then my brother catches it and it drops it. And then there, I lift his arm up so it floats. Yep, <laughs> that's how it does. And also, the ball keeps on falling out sometimes whenever you float it. Yeah. We're making a rocket launch pad and a floating air ball and a spinning astronaut robot. Yep, that's what we're gonna make today. So let's go, Discovery Mind Blown. Here we come. First today, we're playing this game because let's go and let's go straight into the game alrighty so first up I have six of the batteries so today we're gonna open a box that has says discovery mind blown and then stem because it uses to say stem for science technology and economic math and also let's go straight into this box let's see if we can see if you guys can know how to build it if you could get one ask your parents if you want one or you would need to have two boxes yep okay let's go because yeah you could yeah you yeah you could see the left right or to the both sides or the front or the bottom or back okay we started to open the box let's get the pieces out first you get yourself some rocket launch rocket three three pads for a robot spinning floating floating ball and a rocket and this is the air air floating ball and has a one ball for it to float yep and this is the button for rocket launch okay you have the metal metal springers so you could place it on the on and off switch okay we start having the platform after then we started placing the like the floating air air ball condition or something yep and started placing some okay and all right let's see and also get some also you need the box here and also get and that's what you did so take so take a blue wire and so it says to get get one of the blue wires short it's out already and also you take the battery holder that I used to put batteries in and also when you place the battery holder on the platform make sure it's nice and in so it doesn't fall off and we have the ball Oh, okay, and then okay, and started to make get the switch for it to turn on and turning it off. Yep, it it's cool. 
you know? Yeah, right. Soon. <clears throat> okay. All right then. If even when we start building it, you place some um, metal springers for the wire springers, and then you and started placing. Um, Started playing three metal springer and then placed some wires inside the the air air funnel. It's keep on getting out for some reason. Yep, gone. So let's not get to that part anyway. And after that, let's place the blue one in and also, yeah, heck yeah, because it's cool. And also, let's start. And the point in this is how you do it. Place the wires in on on the on the wire springers and pl place one or three of them so it so it doesn't like get out. Yeah, it sometimes gets out whenever I place one. Whoo! Oh, sorry. And also. This is how you go. This is how it goes. Going by on which way you're doing it, and also one wire's got out. I have to place it on the other other wire springer, so it like some uh, get doesn't get out. So after you place that in, so it doesn't like get out. So if, then this is how it goes. This is how it goes by this. And also whenever it doesn't turn on and off, you need to place two battery holders. It also uses to hold batteries, so so if anything doesn't like work, if your batteries are in the wrong position, then take the, the batteries out and then Place it on the right position, and also, and also, whenever it's gonna be turning on or off, place one wire onto the wire springers so it doesn't like uh, get out. So, and also, if it's on, then and then place the ball, and then you got yourself a floating ball. Yes, if you're like going. If you're like going in space and you could see and you can have an apple when you're eating, it could float. After that, that's how it goes. A floating ball. Okay, now on to the next one. We're gonna make a, ourselves a robot spinning machine. It's used for the robot look like it's an astronaut. It more, it, it's like more like an astronaut, yeah. If you want to be an astronaut in space. Okay, so you place the floating ball and then place away the floating ball and on to the next page. The, the spinning robot. So you have four of the batteries and some of, and some four to make the robot. To make the spinning robot. Yes. Oh, also, hmm? and and also we place the robot in. And after that, we take when we see the book. After we built the rocket, and also we have the another box that has the engine to make like uh, like the car with that has an engine on it. Uh, but we'll do that on the next video. Yeah, we'll do that on the next video. Now we're on to the first one, but we'll do the other in the next. And after that. Okay, I have to keep on talking the, the same box when I'm the the box what I'm saying. So I'm placing that back and then 
I put my plush ti tiger plush back too, and then we started. And then after that, we started making. And after that, we build the battery. You get the battery holder, place it down, and get some wire springers to, to make them that they're connecting. And then if you have, then if it's, then you like us. You feel like your robot is, is, well, it is if it's like a, it's not straight, then making it straight, then it, then it goes normal. And then that's how it goes. <laughs> yep. And after that, we started making that, and then we built the s s wire springers. So we put the wires on the springers. So you need to, if you need, you have to put wires on each springer carefully. And also, if you keep watching this, yep, you'll have your mind blown. If you want to see this, this is how it goes by making it very, very careful. And after that, when you place some more wires, and it will, then it will go by actual ways. Yeah. And also place the orange wire inside. It goes in underneath the platform, and then after it's in out. After it's at the top of the platform, then you place it on the spring wire springers, and then you need two wires to place the other springers. So, so it does like go in actual ways. Yeah, this is how it this is how it works. Yep, this is how you could do mathematics and everything. Yep. This is how it goes by. And then after that, if it's finished, place two batteries on the spinning robot. Yep. After that, you place one battery and then two. And then turn it on. And after that, you got yourself the after that if it's go out, then you got yourself a spinning robot. This is how it does. Yep. Or if its hands get stuck on the wire, then you will have to get the wire out of its hand, then it will spin. Yeah, this is how it goes. Yep, if you like, if you love this video, and after that, we started building the rocket, rocket pl platform. And also we need, we need some s battery holders wire 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 springs and and a rocket and a platform a button so so if you want the rocket to be launched and even that's how it goes you need two wires and then you and then you place the wires into one whole platform then after it's in after it gets a bit stuck then you'll have to place it inside, and then you have to take the wires underneath it, then place it in so it like doesn't get out. So, yep, if, if that's how it goes. Even whenever you need to build, build it. That's, and after that, you get the button. Straighten it so it doesn't like get like squiggly or not. And that's how it goes. So place the button to the platform's hole. So that's how it does. After that, and this is how it ends. This is how it goes. And uh, used to uh, place place some wire springers, and you place some, and and also it's even cool to see. Yeah because it's nice and after placing the wire springers you place some you place a bit more wire springers and after that you need 
two you need some wires to place it place the wires to place the wire springers so it doesn't like get turn off turn off your uh, rocket so if it's if it if it's turned off and after you press the button it won't it won't go up that's how it does <sighs> okay and also we could yeah and then after that it is and then place some more wires onto the wire springers but then if you could see the menu carefully on which angle if where which way it goes so yeah <sighs> okay then if it's if it's nice and steady if you place more wires onto this and, and then place it onto the, the wire springers yeah and also and also nice nice and very carefully if you make your rocket launch it's so cool how it goes and how it does even even whenever you do it do things like that yeah and also place two batteries onto the rocket launcher and then if it's placed then and after it's placed then right. <laughs> and then this is how it goes by if it doesn't like work then you have to like fix the wires of the spring wires so so it doesn't like get up so if it works then press it then if it doesn't press then if you if you like press after it doesn't work if you could see the inside of the rocket and at then this is how it goes if it's launched then you then you get surprised to see how it launches so it's it's cool right yeah if you want if you like this this is how it makes it goes by launching it because it's if you had if you had like this in a rocket when you go in a rocket in NASA you could you can find things that is in orbit or something that floats or like or like if you like okay this is how we build a rocket a spinning robot and a floating ball and and also leave a like comment and subscribe make it 12,000 subscribers and if if I could see it on my next video and if you leave a like make it 10,000 likes then I'll uh, upla upload my uh, next video then that's how it goes a floating ball spinning robot and a rocket and also, and also that's how it works after the ball flies and after it gets out it's like if you have an item that floats then you could see if you're going in space that's how it does and your spinning robot and a rocket okay that's that's why you did it we did it though this is how we make the the floating ball, rocket, and the spinning robot. Okay, this, the in this video you could leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and and support my channel for next time. Okay, then, bye. See you in the next video.